Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And as you can see, this stuff is back. This whole massive bundle is back. We're doing a little sales video today and I'm uh, gonna show you some of the things that have just gone out over the last 24 hours. And uh, really just to report that this massive bundle has gone. Thank you to the guy that has bought this. I've done you a really, really good deal on it mainly just because I'm, I'm kind of running out of space. And as you can see, this is taking up quite a lot of room. Uh, so yeah, all of this has gone out for 90 quid uh, plus shipping. It's going to take me quite a while to box all of this stuff up. Uh, so yeah, pray for me, guys. But yeah, finally, it's all gone. Really, really appreciate the guy that's picked it up. So thank you very much. Uh, he's actually going to be building a, a train track room in his spare room for his son. So that sounds really cool. If you are watching the video, make sure you send us a photo of that once it's done. And uh, yeah, it'd be really cool to see all of this stuff uh, in the way that it's supposed to be instead of just in kind of crates, you know. Uh, but yeah, thanks a lot, man. Also, I've got to mention as well that there's also uh, this bundle of trains as well. You've got Percy in there. I think Luke's in there as well. There's Scarlo as well. All of those are working and uh, those are going out for 30. Uh, and there's another little bundle of uh, sort of carriages that we asked for as well, which I've just done for four quid. So, yeah, thanks a lot, man. Nice big bundle coming out to you there. It'll be really interesting to see uh, once that room's all done. Next up, we've got this uh, interactive headwig, and uh, yeah, I'm kind of conscious now that this stuff is in the, going to be in the background for the rest of the video, but here's what it is. <laughs> we've got an interactive headwig, um, I can't remember the name of it, enchanting headwig, I think it's called. Uh, £20 for that, it all sings and dances and moves and all that sort of stuff. Animatronics, what can I say? They're probably one of the greatest concerts of all time. ACDC Live at Donington, absolutely incredible. Uh, tape this uh yeah gone out for i think it's 3.99 not a lot of value in it i actually thought these would have had more value in but uh they didn't unfortunately but yeah still really nice item and this technic stuff uh, is trickling out nicely we've got mega half pipe here this is the danny way um uh version variant i guess 20 quid we've also got this uh, element board as well going out for a fiver these are nice trickling out as well got got quite a few of these still left but quite a lot have already gone now I'm sure everyone's going to remember this track. Daniel Benningfield, got to get through this on vinyl. Uh, yeah, it's not in the greatest condition, but this one's gone out for a tenner. The sleeve's a little bit battered, and uh, yeah, it kind of is what it is. That's why it's only gone out for a tenner. But yeah, good track. Next up, we've got this uh, D-squared, uh, kind of like patched Cub Scouty sort of shirt. I'll throw a photo up on the screen just so you can see it. Uh, but that's quite nice. So I got that for £45 for that one. This here is Buster the Dog, as seen on TV. Uh, I didn't know who he was, so I had to look him up, but he was Paul O'Grady's dog, apparently. So I think you used to get this if you went onto the show, um, because there isn't actually a way, there's no barcode or anything. So I think this was like a gift if you went to the show. But yeah, anyway, Buster, uh, 20 quid for that. Now we've got this Deadpool figure here. This is a uh, Eagle Moss, I think it is. Uh, 13 pound for that, it's quite a nice little one. Deadpool's really in vogue at the moment. I told you, Christmas stuff does sell all year round. So these are uh, Christmas Santa glassy bauble things. Uh, you've got, what is it, 6, 12 in a box. Uh, 20 quid these have gone out for. Next up, we've got this uh, Morphe Richards radio. As you can see, it's a little bit battered. Uh, it's got yellow in on it. It's missing the aerial. Uh, where's the aerial supposed to be? There. Uh, it's missing the arrow that snaps off but this does work the cassette works the radio works the clock doesn't work but even still this has gone out for 25 quid so there's still sort of value in like broken radios and that and uh, this did, didn't take too long to sell now i picked this up only recently this is the battle of the little big horn uh, this is an old waddington's game from like the 60s or the 70s or something um what does it say down there 1964 so there you go copyright 1964 Back the Little Big Horn, all complete, really, really nice condition. Uh, this got out for 30 quid. All right, next up, we've got this like nice little Betty boot box here. And uh, as you can see, it's like musical and stuff. Uh, if you wind up, it plays the tune. Uh, nice little drawer as well. Got the key in there and that as well. So yeah, really nice thing. Uh, this has gone out for £38 for this, so nearly 40 quid for that box. Uh, it's really nice. Took Actually took quite a while to sell, which is unusual. Uh, but I did recently just unlist it and then relist it, so that might be why it's sold. Now, another absolute monstrosity of a packing job uh, is this Batman going out. And uh, it's really nice, big place, actually. It's an awesome thing. It uh, opens up. This, it, you know, I would even say that you could use this as a display thing in a shop, you know. You wouldn't even need to open it up. Just have it standing there as a cool Batman. It's absolutely massive. Uh, it's like, oh, I don't know, like four, three foot tall, four foot tall, something like that. Absolute beast of a thing. So, yeah, I'm going to look forward to packing all this up. Jesus is going to take me absolutely ages. Uh, but yeah, that's going out for 60 quid, that. So, yeah, quite a nice uh, quite a nice little item. Uh, let me see if there's anything else. Hold on. Uh, yeah, just the last thing I guess I'll show you are these Hard Rock Cafe glasses. Bought these at the beginning of the bo uh, boot sale season. Uh, these got out for £15 for the set. Um, probably wouldn't pick these up again, to be honest. I did think these would have had a lot more value in, but they just didn't. I have sold them all now that it's all summer. Um, 
and you know I picked up quite a bundle of them to be fair so I probably would pick them up again if I saw them in such a large amount um, but now that it's coming towards the end of the summer I probably wouldn't so uh, yes definitely a seasonal item I think and uh, yeah we'll, we'll kind of leave it at that I think but yeah we're gonna we've got a whole load of stuff to pack up today and this is going to take me quite a while um, but yeah some really nice strong sales I think some strong value stuff as well um, there wasn't sort of a you know usually like the uh, yeah, there's quite a lot of like little bits and pieces in there, but these are all like nice, large, chunky things, which is kind of what I'm looking to sell at the moment because, uh, like I say, I'm running out of space. So get rid of this Batman, get rid of all of this, uh, this Thomas track and stuff is a big, big help. Um, yeah, awesome. Leave us a like if you enjoyed the video. As you can tell, my voice is kind of going now. <laughs> I've actually filmed four videos. I've been filming for like the last three hours and I'm kind of done with filming videos now, but I just thought I'd get this last one out. We just filmed part one, two and three of that boot sale haul that you've seen. And now this is a sales video. I'm not entirely sure what the order of these videos are going to come out in. So this might sound a little bit weird, but there's, there's you've either seen the part, th part one, two and three or part one, two and three are coming. Uh, but yeah, thanks a lot guys. We'll see you soon. Like and subscribe and all that stuff.